I'm Sharon Carr. I'm an air traffic controller. I belong to the Flying Support Squadron at Tengah Air Base. Our responsibility is to launch and recover aircraft safely and efficiently. Pilots taking off for landing listen to us in the control tower because we have the best view of the situation. This is the control tower. My shift starts at 6 a.m. I start up and check the systems before we launch the aircraft. At any one time, there are four of us in the control tower. On my right is the ground controller. He controls taxiing aircraft and hands them over to me for clearance to take off. On his right is the local assistant who disseminates information to relevant parties. Behind us sits another air warfare officer who acts as the tower executive officer and supervisor. According to Mac Office, the weather is moving southwesterly. Here at my console, I have a radio set that I use to communicate directly with the pilots. This is a wind gauge and the weather radar display, the bearer and hook wire indicators. If an aircraft is an emergency and requires assistance to slow down upon landing, I will need to activate the bearer and the hook wire. And this is a simple graphic aid that helps to keep track of aircraft on the ground as well as in the air. We may have up to six aircraft on our frequency at any point in time. We need to make decisions on the spot and be clear with our instructions. When aircraft are coming in to land at 140 knots or 250 kilometers per hour, you only have one chance to get it right. Wombat Depart Western Coast, clear takeoff to 6 Center. Surface wind is calm, very hook while you're up. Airborne contact approach, thank you. Sounds complicated, but all I really did was tell the pilot his departure profile, which runway to take off on, the wind, as well as the bearer hook status, and the agency to call upon departure. We are like a family here at Tanga. I started here and have been here for four years. People ask what it feels like to be a woman in a male-dominated environment. I would say that I've never felt different from anyone else. Some might say it's stressful to be in the control tower making split-second decisions. To me, it's thrilling. It's never a boring moment. Singapore has a small airspace with many civilian aircraft, and I'm glad to do my part to keep the small airspace safe and free. I'm Captain Sharon Carr, and I'm an airman.